good evening and welcome to the Museum of Islamic Art on this beautiful early June evening, golden hour here, uh, probably half an hour before sunset. Magnificent the building here. There's this great glass walkway uh, bet uh, here on floor three between the uh, different e exhibits. There's this magnificent floor to ceiling uh, window, and then in the in, in, on the ground floor there's a lovely cafe where you can sit out and have something to eat or drink with this magnificent view. And um, here. There's Gallery 10, which is where I'm going to start my uh, tour of the exhibits in the building. And it's uh, the Mediterranean Sea of Exchange. The sea is an unknown that demands great vigilance. Behind this sea, there are so many nations and countries that reap enormous benefits from maritime activities. Beware that the sea is an asset for you. It is a source of life. It provides you daily sustenance and maritime commerce generates great profits. So that was from the 7th century AH or the 13th century CE by an Arab traveller. So let's go and have a look at what exhibits await. This is a good one. It's um, a mosque lamp uh, from the Ottoman period uh, in the 1500s, so the 16th century, Henry VIII's time. No history of the museum really should be without a sword. Here we have a long sword. section of the uh, museum. Some beautiful artifacts and uh, jewellery and also uh, these objects here. So here we have a chest and a back ornament from Indonesia, Sumatra, um, from the 13th century uh, or 19th century, so the 1800s. As we would know it, this impressive crisscross chest and back ornament is a type of jewellery commonly associated with the culturally rich regions of Aachen. It was worn by women on special occasions, most frequently at weddings. This section is about the beginning of Islam and then also uh, knowledge and science. Um, the middle, middle ages and, and onwards early modern period and uh, oh here we have a sundial uh, made in France I think it was during the Napoleonic period about 1798 magnificent
engraving from the 12th century common era. Beautifully done. So these are the stairs, central stairs, down to the ground floor where there's, a, as you see, a little cafe and a, and a gift shop and also normally some exhibits. But I see the, uh, the temporary exhibition hall there is, uh, is not open. They must have shut that for the day. So maybe just a little look around the gift shop before going home. So thank you for joining me today and I'll see you on the next one.